All right, well, we continue to highlight the businesses partnering with us for CBS 19's favorite things giveaway, and this is actually one of my family's favorite spots in East <laughs> Texas. The business all started with a woman who took a dessert that's been around for nearly a century and put her own unique spin on it. We're talking about caramel apples and the delicious creations made by the Apple Gal. We're joined by none other than the Apple Gal herself, Morgan Francis. Morgan, thank you so much for joining us. Thank you for having me. I'm so excited. Yeah. So excited. You know, I am so curious how you, your business started in very humble beginnings. Tell us yes. how it all started. <clears throat> it started um, with just an idea that I had seen on Pinterest and I saw a caramel apple. I don't even know what I saw. Some kind of apple and I thought I could do that. I can do that. And so I started making them for my teachers. It got out of hand and I quit and then I started back up after I had my son. There you go. Yeah. Awesome. Yeah. So what apple do we have today that we're trying? Today we have a traditional apple pie, which is one of my, it's like the third flavor I ever did. That's and awesome. it's one of my favorites. Well, you know, I'm, I'm really curious. When did you realize that your business was a hit? Because I knew, <laughs> I've been following, I mean, obviously a little disclosure for the audience. <laughs> she knows my grandmother and it's my true. uncle too, because she's true. from Van. Mm -hmm. So <laughs> when did you know that your business was a huge hit? I think um, I'm still in denial. Like, is it <laughs> a hit? I don't know. I, I am in so, I think maybe when it really hit was when I opened my door one day to get my mail and the mailman was there and he goes, hey, you're the Apple girl. And it's like, maybe maybe it's really taken off. Well, I gotta tell you, I'm trying the apples and they've always been good. And this thank especially you. is amazing. Thank you, thank you. So yeah. what are some of the holiday flavors you have? Okay, so holiday flavors are pretty limited with the uh, peppermint white mocha. And then we have a gingerbread coming out. But the what I have here are the holiday designs, which are a hot commodity. Mm -hmm. I've got snowmen and melted snow, and um, I believe this one's a Christmas tree. So these are f delicious chocolate flavors, but the designs are really what sell it. Yeah, that's awesome. Mm -hmm. So tell me, why do you do this just so much? What inspires you? Um, I honestly, my kids, which could be cliche, but my kids just doing something, showing them that you can have an idea, and then if you work hard enough and long enough that it could turn into something. Yeah. So just inspiring my kids, showing them that hard work really does pay off. Yeah, it absolutely do, does pay off. So what are you donating as a part of our CBS 19's Favorite Things giveaway? Okay, so I am donating apples, a coffee mug, which these are my favorite coffee mugs. I was kind of excited to be able to drink out of a coffee mug on a morning <laughs> show. It's kind of my dream. But, and then I've got a $50 gift card for the lucky winner as well. Awesome. Well, thank you so much. Yeah. I know we're really looking forward to it. And tell us where people can find your business. <clears throat> so we are out off Earl Campbell by... Uh, True Vine, the brewery, if you're familiar, there's such a beautiful addition out there. Um, and it is off, it's on 2459 Mosaic Way is my address. But if you go to Sam's, if you're out in that direction in West Tyler, it's out off Earl Campbell. Awesome. Well, thank you so much, Morgan, yeah. for joining us this morning. Yeah. And again, like she mentioned, what she's donating is a $50 gift card and a coffee mug and mm -hmm. all other holiday items. You can head over to CBS19.tv to enter to win. Yep. And you can also check out the Abigail, like she said, at her address at 2459 Mosaic. So, yep. Morgan, thank you so much for joining us. Yeah, thank you so much. Let's get over head over to Sarah with the weather.